Okay. Now we move on to Economic Society of South Africa or ESSA, and then uh, these five links shows you the uh, website for the last five conferences. But I think the bad news is this one to two thousand and twenty one uh, conference. Okay, I think the website is not publicly available yet. So in other words, only the conference paper, research paper presenters. They are the only ones who can uh, log into this website and, and have access to all the research papers. By the way, for this ESSA conference, ESSA conference, it is the most prestigious uh, local economic conference. And then the conference takes place every two years, actually. Maybe before we randomly look at one or two conference websites, maybe we first visit the official ESSA website. Economic Society of South Africa. Okay. I think it shows you information about the history of ESSA prizes and awards, uh, conferences, the name of the current or the former ESSA president. Okay. Okay. So you can have a look of this website if you have time. Okay. And hopefully you will win the stu student prizes one day. I think they have got like three categories of medals. Best Honours Research Essays, Best Master's Thesis, and Best PhD Dissertation. Okay, so now let's visit the 2019 ESSA conference website. Okay, so it took place in September in Johannesburg, 2019. I actually took part in the... Uh, conference, not only me, but uh, other uh, UWC economics colleagues. And then that's the schedule. And then for the full program, you should be able to download the uh, papers. Okay, but maybe you wonder why for this one, there is no link to download anything. I think it could be because the presenters uh, did not submit any anything electronically to the conference organizer. Okay, so maybe Let's say this one, risk preference and job mobility in Zimbabwe. So save as, okay, again, I save on the desktop. Okay, so this is the conference paper. Okay, okay, so you can have a look, okay. And then, as I said in the first video for the conference papers, some of them could turn out into working papers or even accredited uh, journal publications. Okay, so presenting at a conference is actually the first step, one of the earlier stages of your research journey, because only by presenting your research findings at research conference, then you receive meaningful, constructive feedback from the audience. Then you will know how to improve or, or amend the research paper further, let's say for uh, publication purposes. Okay. Then I think we can move on to ERSA, Economic Research Southern Africa. So don't get confused between ERSA and ESSA. They are two different institutions, although both of them are based in South Africa. And then the ERSA, they have a working paper series, actually. So let me paste the link here. And again, if you have time, you can visit the ERSA website. I think they have got some training courses available. Payment may or may not be involved. And then again, it gives you information about the team, the staff who work at Ursa. But let's focus on the working paper series. It's, so let's say this one. At the time of creating this video, Ursa already released working paper up to number 869. So they have got like nearly 900 working papers. So you might wonder, am I going to scroll down the list? all the way until the end the answer is no because you need to make use of the internal search engine to type some keywords then hopefully you would find the uh, types of working papers that you want okay so maybe i randomly type poverty south africa and let's see what's going to happen Okay, so this is the search results. 2018 August, there's a working paper in connection with uh, uh, female poverty. Okay, and then another working paper, 2011, it's about the 
distributional implication of halving poverty in South Africa when growth alone is not enough and so forth. Okay, poverty and headships, poverty, inequality, production linkages. Okay, okay. So I think I have discussed the ESSA conference website and the ERSA working paper series. So I will see you in the next video.